Okay, so I don't know if this video is actually going to like be one video, but I'm gonna try playing every single Obby King Remastered Obby. Um, I mean, I don't think it's actually. I don't think single player actually has all of them, but I hope it does. So I've actually played some of these, but I'm just gonna play them for the sake of this video. I'm gonna start with. I'm gonna go like A to Z order, cause I don't know. That's like the best order i guess okay this obvious might be kind of difficult with my stupid big head i think i want to change that later okay i never actually played this map i've never seen this map apparently the creator of this game got into some drama or something but i'm really tired of Shut the fuck. i'm really tired of like roblox creators popular roblox creators getting to some stupid drama i mean it's just a normal thing nowadays those stupid obbies are like concrete obby stud obby uh cobblestone obby like I don't know about you, but like, I feel like they're the worst start type of hobbies. Cause they're usually just like garbage gameplay repeating at least. Okay, a weeping willow. I've also never seen this. I haven't really played most of the a letter hobbies. Okay, a weeping willow. Yeah, I have never seen this. I've never even seen anything about this. Good start. I mean, I mean, I know it's just like simple as jumps, but still better than playground escapade i don't think i'm actually gonna beat playground escapade es escapade or something there's like it's one of those maps with like a stupid lava part or like like example like this lava over here or something like a kill brick and then you have to step on boxes something like that it has like a bunch of those and it's usually like so buggy like i don't like it when people place the obstacles way too close to the lava because you usually like you have to um target the highest ground i hope like i don't play uh, you know those stupid obbies that are like, like, okay wait, this is like one area and then you teleport to the next area in like a horizontal line until the end Where it's just like a tiny pad, there's no like cool section Like, it's like rainbow obby and like, I mean, I mean no, it's wrong name, but rainbow rampage It's like rainbow rampage and like, um It's not more maps like that actually, but I don't really remember the names Okay, this is the first trust in this video first of many wow okay that's interesting it's like the first map i mean this is like the second map where it's actually i'm like i've seen that's actually like collidable i mean half of, oh no when it's so close to the ground okay, okay. i just didn't like randomly i'm gonna try this time flux had a flux has a similar pro problem except the whole ground is lava but it has a similar problem where like you're it's like a pretty long jump that's like very close to the lava and then like when you when you take the long jump climbing it just i mean like if you like climb on that jump you have like the highest risk of dying because if you climb it then your legs can touch the lava and just die probably because the effect thing that's kind of called like false kills you which is kind of stupid honestly okay that's it i don't really like these very long maps especially that uh wait there was like another map I forgot what it was called, but like I played it on a public server. Uh, Astro Paradise? Whoa, we spawned an abandoned house or something. Yeah, I guess this cabin really is abandoned. Okay, the f okay, right on the bat. Here? No? Okay, what is it? What even is the first obstacle? Oh. You really just put like Minecraft fences where you cannot jump over them. <sighs> I don't like this to be a leap, leap of faith jumps. Like, I don't like even obvious of like. A leap of faith jump, oh my god. Oh my. God, I don't even know. Okay. I want me to go there. I like it when people put arrows and then like, it looks like an obstacle. It's like Golden Valley where like, there's an arrow, like a floating arrow that looks like an obstacle. And I fall for that like three times. Like, I don't know why. It's just like mental torture. I played the map multiple times, but like I still fall for that all the time. I have like a strategy of the tight ropes where like, I use my cursor. Like the, the cursor is like a straight line, so I can use it as like, like the center or something. I don't like these tight ropes. Oh my. Please. This was so. Finally. I mean, I'm, uh, don't celebrate already. Okay, I almost immediately die. Where do I go? Here. No, I have to do another one. I died to this like three times and you want me to do another one. <sighs> Finally, I'll. This game's so scary. Like, when you get past a difficult part, like, it's so scary. Even if the obstacles are so easy. Oh, what's this? Do I have to jump on that or do I have to jump? Okay, just jump in here. You're not supposed to jump on that. No, why another one? This. 
No, why do you do? No! Hoop, hoop, bam. I get really scared for those stupid leap of, leap of faith jumps. Cause there has been so many times where I overestimate a jump. And then there's, I mean, and then like one time in Plague, I don't know, wrong. Island Paradise? Island Paradise. One time in Island Paradise, one of the leap of faith jumps, like I kind of underestimated. Cause like, I've, I've underestimated so many like leap of faith jumps, but, and then that was like the only time I actually underestimated. And I was like, okay, you know what? They're even that, they're not even that bad. I'm just jumped so early for no reason. Is this it? Oh, that was, oh, that was not where you go. My main avatar is like a giant big head, a huge head, uh, I think. I mean, I call it big head, but it's actually a huge head. Like, you can see it's in my profile picture. That's my main avatar. But I never use it because I play Flutscape 2 and, like, you really have to, like, see your jumps. <laughs> Whoa, where do you go? Okay. Okay, that's where I died. Stupid dumb idiot. Scary obstacles. Stupid tight ropes. Stupid everything. Everything stupid. Please. That took seven minutes. I hope the time limit of this map isn't seven minutes. I hope it is seven minutes. Or like maybe nine minutes. How? What? What is like a max time? Is it seven? Please. Four minutes? That was way too hard for. F oh, whatever. One more abandoned map, then I'm just gonna skip that. Oh, uh, this is what I was talking about. Okay. Most of the obvious in this game. There it is. Most of the obvious in this game are kind of more nerve control than like difficult. It's like in my stupid like hardest parts of every heavy two map video where like most of the reasons just like panic, this map, panic, coding bunker, panic, ignis avatary, panic, uh random map, panic, the the last map of the entire video, panic. Imagine waiting like in the premiere just waiting for like the hardest part of the last map, like oh what's the reason? It's just panic. Very um very overused and whoa oh my god boring you go i don't know how this game has so many obstacles that are close to other areas of the map and i hope you cannot hear the music i cannot tell if it's got wow that was <laughs> that was six minutes shorter than the last one I, oh, skip that. I mean skipping that for now i've actually played that so i don't really like i'm not really scared to skip it I'm not really scared to skip Abandoned Factory, if I already know it. I hate the fact that all these maps are in night, like, why is it so dark? Okay. Also, one of my favorite parts of this game is that, like, you know how the Leap of Faith things? I mean, you know, I just talk about how, like, a lot of the obstacles are near sections of, I mean, other sections of the map. So, like, it's very hard to tell. It's like the Abandoned Cabin thing, where, like, I didn't know where to go. And like, I was already close to the end, but I just went the wrong way. Like... One of my favorite things is when they put an X to like the leap of faith thing. I call it a leap of faith thing. It's like they put an X, like it's just so good. But my one of my complaints of it is like sometimes there could be two leap of faiths pretty close to each other. And then you think the uh, then you think the other one that's like pretty close to the astral path is the astral leap of faith thing. Leap of faith thing. Yeah, see this is the X I'm talking about so cool but like sometimes it can be like over here and then like oops um that's not the right path i guess i have to start over again every mistake should feel like the player's fault except for when something is kind of like false which i'm not gonna talk about because i'm really mad about that but like no one really cares so i don't want to talk about it okay like for example i i think that this is i, I fall i fell for this at the ending of astral paradise i think this is a main obstacle i go there but in reality, it's not a main, and not, not only is it not a main obstacle, but it's kind of like false, so you cannot even like, you, is, you don't know, you just don't know. Also, I don't like it when like, oh my god, I'm just complaining at this point, oh uh, like, I don't like it when like, those stupid pools thing, like, it masks like abandoned harbor. I'm gonna smack my table. A mass like abandoned factory, not not harbor. Why do I say harbor? Mass like abandoned factory. It's just this random like oil pool thing that kills you. But like sometimes it's just so unexpected. Like like I always I always almost die to them, and like when they have them, cause like they're just really close. Okay, wait, let me do this obstacle course for a second. Okay, example, like, I go up here, and then this is, like, model pool, like, immediately right after, like, for some reason, I don't know if it's just me, but I just keep dying. Oh, this got some nerves. 
I just keep dying to stuff like that. So far, I've only played like three maps in this game that have checkpoints. Or maybe two, I don't actually know. Whoa, 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 this is scary. This is so scary. This reminds me of that Crimson Core Trust. Crimson Core? Like, I mean, I already like Crimson Core because of that one trust part. But it's so scary on balance and everything, but like, I just love it. I don't know why, but like, I just love the trust part. You know, the, you, the part where you like jump off. Oh, that's it. The part where you like, like, the jump here and uh, you barely climb a truss or something like that. Like, I just like that part. Also, I think I'm going to cancel the original idea of this video and I'm, I think I'm gonna turn it into. Uh, okay, so I was actually going to do all of this, but if an average hobby takes like three minutes. Uh, okay, this is a new idea. So this video is going to be titled Beating Every Obby King Remaster Map Starting with A Or something I don't know how I'm going to title that but I hope I do And I hope I do actually edit this video because I, I actually made Grinding Moons episode 8 Or 9, I don't actually know where uh, Grinding Moons episode 8 But like that video was recorded 2 days ago I think And I haven't done any editing progress on it because I'm not actually editing editing it right now. Like, you just don't want to edit videos when you really want to. Oh my god. Also, I don't know how these things are kind of like false. I was just, I mean, I just talked about that. I think I like, abandoned the depot. Oh yeah, isn't this another map with checkpoints? Wait, that's just not with checkpoints? I swear to god, it's not with checkpoints. Wait, no, it doesn't. Oh, oh I thought a slime factory that has checkpoints. And also, uh, what other map has checkpoints again? What? Oh, outdoor training. One of, my, one of the interesting things about it is that it has a zip line, which I've never actually seen any map have. Like, I've never seen another map with a zip line. I feel like outdoor training is the only map in the entire game to have a zip line. Oh yeah, the lava thing I was talking about. Also, I forgot. Ah, this, the, 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 model, the puddle jump scare thing I talked about in Acidic Wasteland. Okay, whatever. I hope this because of an actual video. I don't want this to be just like some filler video that no one's gonna give a crap about. Oh, oh yeah, there, there it is. Okay. Oh, Arcade Adventure? I think I've actually, oh, I played this before, but I don't remember. I don't remember this. I don't, I don't remember this. I don't remember that stupid idiot. Hmm. I don't remember playing this. Did I get how? Did I play this five years ago? Please, I kind of underestimate the trust. Oh my god, I, gotta be kidding. I don't really trust the ladder physics in this game. This game has ladder jumping like in Flutscape 2. But like, I don't trust them because considering how bad Flutscape 2 trusses are, I don't believe the trusses in this game too. Or either. I, I don't know. I don't remember too. <sighs> I assumed that was going to kill me. I thought it was going to be some kind of like cannon thing that like broke or something. Oh, there it is. I don't remember beating this in a minute. I swear to god. Astro Village. Oh, this map is pretty interesting. Oh, I don't like these tiny like... Oh my god. Everything's the same texture. Uh, it's so confusing to look at. This is so weird. Like, I didn't even. Could you even tell that was gra. Could you tell there was a, uh, like an elevated jump there? But I did copy. Whoa. I knew that would kill me. I was just gonna talk about. Is it the typos that kill you or is it the platforms that kill you? It's the platforms. I thought they were platforms. What is this even supposed to be? What even is an. What? Oh, it's a trust. I don't know where to go. There. Thanks. So glad there's a giant arrow, cause I wouldn't have got. What is that? Oh, I'm scared if this is like this to be guess the platform. Okay. Okay, next page uh, or um last level. Is that a wall jump? No, that's like an orgy trust. Mm. Ooh, the orgy trust. Also, that wasn't actually an orgy trust. It's just supposed to climb. Oh, whoa. The what? Oh, it's like two way orgy trust. Mm. Oh, you're not even supposed to do that, but I prefer doing an orgy trust than like lazily climbing on a box like a dumb idiot. I, I feel like RG trusses would be way better if trust physics were actually like not broken. Imagine how cool this game would be. Also, why won't why won't there be this map has such bad indications for wraparounds? Like, I couldn't even tell that was a wrap for a second. Okay, you have this stupid thing. I don't even know what you call it. It's called a like back. I mean, I don't know what you call the jumps where like you like ju go jump back and then like forward again to go to another platform also that was a pretty hard jump i'm also kind of scared of this map because time limit for this map is actually eight minutes which is this map so big there's still more where's the ending uh, i'm too scared i think it's there i see the ending's there what's the jump i don't like the jumps that look way too long i hope i know where i'm going okay i can tell the gray parts so are kind of like false
There to here. It's confusing as hell. I already took, I already took that because like, hmm, I wonder what's in here. But like, it wasn't blood by invisible wall, so I got way more confused. Mm, I'm so scared of what kills me. I mean, I know it's only water that kills me. What, what if like some random crap, like poisonous leaves? What if just random images that don't load on the ground kills me? No, ah, my pain and suffering is finally come. It's finally finished, even though that was three minutes. So I actually remember playing this map while listening to Nekozilla by Different Heaven. Also, how is this made by the same idiot who made Central Assembly? I remember when the whole purpose of me playing Obby King Remastered was to hop into single player and then just play this map while listening to like Nekozilla by Different Heaven. If you somehow don't recognize their name, is uh, this song. I don't know why, but that's like one of the only things I remember about playing this game. Every time I see this game, I, I always think of that as I'm like, Obby King Remastered. Oh yeah, isn't that the game where I play? Uh, I think. I knew it, 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 I knew it. I was wondering like, why aren't people doing that shortcut? And now I know why. Because, ele uh, of course it's a map made by Electroblast. I'm not even surprised that there's an invisible wall there. Okay, I don't, <laughs> It's only been like two times where I've seen like boxes as decoration and they're actually kind of like true. For some, for some reason, they're always kind of like false. I don't know why. What's this, what is this, what is this? Oh! That's it? Now I, now I know why. Okay, I think that might be the end of the, Yeah, this is gonna be the end of the video. I hope you actually watched a second of this video. Abandoned Cabin. So, Abandoned Cabin was a pretty difficult map. How is this medium? Wait, I'm, I'm gonna try finding a hard map. Hard? Hard. This is hard. This is hard. Okay, I mean, that was pretty hard. Right? You call this hard and not this. Okay, yeah, I think that's the end of this video. I hope I actually edited this time. I mean, it's only 30 minutes. Why? Why not edit it?